So welcome to class everybody, I'm Shavita and today's class is going to be a flow to promote digestion and to help reduce bloating. So let's begin the class by lying in, coming into child's pose. So over the Christmas period, if you're on holidays, you know, we usually indulge a little bit more with food and drink. And sometimes our digestive system is compromised. And today's class will help to get everything flowing again. So come onto your mat and congratulate yourself for getting on the mat over this holiday period. So this class will help you get back on track and get you centered and connected to your body again. And hopefully it'll set the tone for the day. Surrendering on your mat, giving yourself permission to be here. This is your time, your little sneaky time you've taken off for you to look after yourself. Coming up onto all fours. Inhale, look up. Exhale, look down. Inhale, look up. Exhale, look down. Beautiful. Inhale, look up. Exhale, look down. Neutralize your spine. Let's just tuck the toes under and lift the knees up. Pull the belly button in. Activate those abs. And bring it down. Inhale, lift up. Activating those abs. And bringing it down. And this time we're going to bring it into the full downward facing dog. So let's just walk it out. Get your position of your feet and your hands nice and comfortable for your downward facing dog. Everybody's different depending on the length of your arms, your torso and your legs. So just bend the knees for me, straighten out your spine, come into a high plank and then bend the knees coming back into a downward facing dog, flowing it out. High plank, downward facing dog, beautiful. High plank, bend the knees, downward facing dog. And let's just pick up the right leg. Picking up the right leg, bend the knee, and let's just give our hips a bit of a circle one way. We may be sitting, we may have been sitting on the couch, you know, enjoying our holidays, and this is just to get things moving. And let's change sides, left leg, lifting it up, bending the knee, and circling the hip one way and then the other way beautiful and then let's just lean forward onto your hands and step the right foot forward drop the left knee down bring the hands to the inside of the foot and circle again one way and sometimes when we're really busy over the holiday Christmas period, our muscles and our hips can get tight. We can hold on to a bit of stress and tension there. We want to release it in class today. Frame your foot and then stretch out your hamstring. Really pulling. Imagine you're energetically pulling your buttocks to the back wall. And bend. And extend. And bend and extend bend the knee touch down left hand right hand up frame the foot kick it back into a downward facing dog and let's lean forward step the left foot forward bring the left foot to the inside of your hands and circle one way and circle the other way Framing the foot, leaning the buttocks back, and bending the knee. Leaning the buttocks back, and bending the knee. One more time, energetically taking the buttocks to the back wall. Bending the knee, touch down right hand, left hand up. Frame the foot, kick back into downward facing dog. And then now come up onto your toes, Drop the heels down, up onto your toes, drop the heels down, 
and then walk your feet towards your hands. Grab hold of your elbows. Keep your knees bent and just focus on your breath. Going from side to side, side to side. Let go of those elbows. Bring your feet together. Tuck the neck in. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, tuck the neck in. Inhale, reaching up to the ceiling. Exhale, forward bend. Tuck in the neck. Open up your feet, hip distance apart. Place your right hand to the middle of your body. Bend the right knee. Inhale, lift up the left. So when we're twisting in class, we're promoting the digestive system to be stimulated. And change sides. Left hand to the middle of your body. Bend the left knee. Lift up the right hand. Beautiful. Tuck the neck in. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, tuck the neck in. Inhale, reach up to the ceiling. Lean slightly back, exhale, forward bend. We will repeat that. Right hand to the middle of your body. Bend the right knee, inhale, lift up the left. Lengthen your spine. Change sides, left hand down, bend in the left knee, inhale, lift up your hand. And remember when we're practicing any practices in our lives, it's about consistency. Tuck in the neck, Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, tuck in the neck. Inhale, lifting up. Beautiful, forward bend. This time, we're bringing the heels and toes together, bending the knees in a chair, bringing the hands up, hands to prayer. We're taking the left elbow to the outside of the, I mean, right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Make sure both your knees are in line. Sometimes one knee tends to come Forward, straight spine, and release. Heel toe your feet, hip distance apart. Grab hold of your big toe with your two piece fingers. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, coming down. Breathing in, breathing out. You can have your knees bent as much as you need. And then release those heel toes, your feet together, back into the chair. Hands to prayer. And we're taking the left elbow to the outside of the right knee. Press your palms together and twist. Think of your digestive system stimulating. And then gently release back into the chair. Palms together, forward bend. Tuck the neck in. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, tuck the neck in. Frame the foot. Right leg back. Left leg back. And you can come into a downward facing dog or you can flow it out. Tricep push up. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Beautiful. Breathing in, breathing out. And just stay here with your breath. Nice long deep breaths in. Nice long deep breaths out. Lean forward onto your hand. Step your right foot forward. Left foot forward, tuck in the neck. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, tuck in the neck. Inhale, lifting up. Forward bend, tuck the neck in. Inhale, lengthen the spine, shoulders away from your ears. Beautiful. Exhale, tuck in the neck in. Frame the foot, left leg back. Right leg back. Downward dog. Or flow it out, tricep push up, upward facing dog, downward facing dog, breathing it out. Beautiful. Let's lean forward onto your hands, step your right foot forward, and this time we're bringing the hands up. Bringing the hands up, bring the palms together. Lean forward, left elbow to the outside of the right knee. Holding it here for three. Lengthen your spine. Two, one. Beautiful. Inhale, lift up those hands. 
Step the back foot forward slightly. Bring the hands on the hips. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, reach, reach, reach. Now extend your left hand out. Bring the left hand to the outside of your right foot, twisting and extending the left hand up. And then gently frame the foot, kick back into downward facing dog or flow it out. Try a step push up. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. And breathe. You should be really feeling the heat warming up your body, your inner fire. Warming up the body. Lean forward onto your hands. Step your left foot forward. Inhale, bring the hands up. Palms together. Push those palms together. Lean forward. Right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Beautiful, you're doing so well. Open it up if you want to. And then bring the hands back. Step the back foot forward. Hands on your hips. Pivot your hips to the front of the room. Inhale, lengthen. Reach forward, reach the right hand up. Bring the right hand to the outside of the left foot. Extend the arm if you want to, holding it for three, two, one. Bend in the knee, kicking back, either into downward facing dog or flow it out. Tricep push up, upward facing dog, downward facing dog. Beautiful. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Lean forward onto your hands. Step your right foot forward. Inhale, lift up those arms. Let's just open up our heart, plunging it down for three. Lean back, lift your chest up to the ceiling. Two, one. Bring the hands behind you. Open up your chest. Pivot the back foot 45 degrees. Come into a humble warrior for three, two, one, lift the hands up. We're coming into warrior. Beautiful, sinking down with the front leg, palm facing up, reaching forward, coming up. For three, two, one. Side angle, elbow on the knee. Inhale, reach up that hand. For three, two, one. Beautiful, coming up. Both toes facing the front, shoulders back. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, reach towards me. Hands on the mat, inhale, lengthen, exhale, coming down. Leaning slightly forward onto your toes. Breathing in and breathing out. Walking your hands to the back of the room, framing the foot. And then kicking back either into a downward facing dog or we're going into a flow. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog, beautiful. And breathe here. Breathing in, breathing out. The energy is flowing through our body. The fire is activated within us. Leaning forward onto your hands. Step the left foot forward. Bring the hands up. Cactus arms, lifting your chest up, opening up your chest, lunging it down for three, two, one. And bring the hands behind you. Open up your chest, pivot the back foot, 45 degree angle, and humble warrior. For three, two, one. Coming into our warrior. Beautiful. Breathe. Reach forward. Side angle. Hands over your head. Chest towards the ceiling. And then coming back into looking towards me with your feet facing towards me. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, coming down. Coming down, coming down, coming down. Hands on the mat. Lengthen your spine. Exhale, coming down. And breathing in. And breathing out. And breathing in. Wiggling your buttocks left, right, left, right. 
place your right hand on the mat. Inhale, lift up your left. Change sides, left hand on the mat. Inhale, lift up your right. Bring the hands to the front of the room. Frame the foot. Kick back, either in a downward facing dog or flow it out. Tricep push up. Upward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Now bring the heels together and the toes are pointed out. Glue your thighs together. Come into a high plank and then open the legs into like a, a frog. Open and close. Abs fold in for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Squeeze those sides together. 3, 2, one and then come back into downward facing dog beautiful let's just drop the right knee down the knee and the hand the right knee and the hand are in line and so is the left foot we're going to lift that hand up the left hand and lift that leg up tap it down and lift down and lift for five four three two one, beautiful. We're gonna come and lift, take our feet nice and wide, heels in line with your knees, and then we're just gonna come down onto our elbows. So you can lean forward and back, play around with it to find that inner thigh stretching out. And that's your drainage nook there in between your hip and your thigh to help with bloating. So we wanna just stretch it out Hold it here and really focus on your breath. Beautiful. Two more breaths, inhaling and exhaling. Inhaling and exhaling. Then we're gonna come back and we're gonna go onto the other side. Ah, this looks this side. So hand, left hand, left knee, right foot in one line. Lift that hand up, lift it up and tap. Up and tap. Up and tap. For five, four, three, two, one. And then again, we're going to open up those knees nice and wide. So you can go a little bit wider this time. And then lean forward, coming down onto your elbows. And make that adjustment by leaning forward or back slightly, whatever suits you. And find that groin stretch. And breathe, breathing in and breathing out. Let's take two more breaths, breathing in. And breathing out, breathing in and breathing out. And then slowly coming back. And let's sit comfortably in a cross-legged position. And this time we're going to bring the heel away from the shin. We're walking our fingers forward. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in. Breathing in, breathing in, breathing out. And then gently walk your hands back and then grab hold of that front foot, pop it into the crease of your elbow. We're gonna rock the baby. This one helps to stimulate the digestive system too because we're compressing the, the abdominal muscles. Almost massaging it.
and then gently release, change sides. Walking those fingers forward. Stay connected to your breath. And slowly walking your hands back. Bring that hand, the foot into the elbow crease and we're going to rock the baby. And then gently release. So sitting in a comfortable position. We're going to inhale, lift up the hands. Grab hold of the elbows. Inhale, lift, exhale, come down to one side. And again, inhale, lift, exhale, coming down to the other side. Have both legs nice and long. We're going to bend the right foot and pop it over the left. Bring that right hand behind you. Inhale, lift up the left and let's twist. So really straighten out your spine and twist and twist and twist beautiful let's do the other side popping your left foot over your right knee bringing that left hand beside behind your back inhale lengthen exhale elbow tucked to the outside of your left knee inhale lengthen exhale twist inhale lengthen exhale twist one more time inhale lengthen Exhale, twist. Beautiful. Legs nice and long. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, coming down. This will get the blood flowing. We've had a couple of days off from yoga. This will help get all that energy moving and flowing. Get your body functioning to its maximum capacity, your digestive system, your lymphatic system. Gently release, one foot tucked in, inhale, lengthen, exhale, twist, coming down. And gently release, change sides, inhale, lengthen, exhale, rotate, come down. And then both legs come in front. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, come down. Relax your shoulders and breathe. Feel your lower back getting stretched, your hamstrings getting stretched, relaxing your shoulders down your neck, away from your shoulder, um, ears. And then gently come into a sitting position. Let's bring the hands on our shoulders and release some of those tensions we may be holding on to in our necks. Elbows together, exhale down. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. And then back, elbows together, lifting up and down. Beautiful, use your breath. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift, exhale, down. Inhale, lift, exhale, down. Hands resting on those knees. Exhale, look down. Inhale, look up. Exhale, down. Inhale, look up. Exhale, down. Inhale, look up. Back to the center, turn your head to the right. And the left. And the right. And the left. Back to center, ear to shoulder. Change. Breathe. Change. Change. And just drop your shoulders down, lean slightly back, tuck your chin in. 
And before we lie down into our relaxation, I want you to really just focus on your breath. Just take a nice big exhale for three, two, one. Inhale for three, two, one. Exhale for three, two, one. Beautiful. Stay connected to that breath. We're going to lie down on the mat. Lying down on the mat. Hugging your right knee in. Pull it in a little bit more. Rotate your foot one way. Rotate your foot the other way. Bring your knee over your body. Turn your head away and bring that hand up. You can really open up your chest. And then gently coming down. Inhale, lifting up, hugging that knee. Rotate your foot one way. Rotate your foot the other way. Then bring your knee over your body. Turn your head away. And then gently release, hugging your knees. Have a little rock one way and have a little rock the other way. And really acknowledge your commitment to yourself during the holiday period that you've made this little time to do an express cast for yourself. It's about consistency. So if you don't have time to do these express classes, there's always the 10 minute ones that you can choose to do. If you feel like something a bit longer, there's the 45 minute ones that you can do. But do something, a little bit, consistency. That's the key. Just lying down on your mat, we're just gonna do a little short meditation and acknowledgement of thyself. Just focus on your breath moving through your body. Nothing else to think about but your breath. Take your breath, take your attention to your toes. You're relaxing your toes, you're relaxing your toes. Relax your ankles, relax your ankles. You're relaxing your calves, you're relaxing your calves. Your knees are relaxed, your knees are relaxed. Relax your thighs, relax your thighs. Take your breath, take your attention to your hips. You're relaxing your hips, you're relaxing your hips. Take a big breath into your belly, you're relaxing your belly, you're relaxing your belly. Your lower backs relax, your lower backs relax. Take a big breath into your chest, you're relaxing your chest, you're relaxing your chest. Your upper backs relax, your upper backs relax. Relax your shoulders, relax your shoulders. The back of your necks relax, the back of your necks relax. You're relaxing your jaw, your tongue, your lips all relax. Cheek muscles are relaxed, your forehead's relaxed. And just give yourself permission to just be here with your breath, just for a few minutes of the day. Slowly 
wiggling your toes, wiggling your fingers, turning your head left to right. And in this space you've just created, think of the three things that you're grateful for today. Three things that you're grateful for today. It could be just turning up on the mat and having the discipline to do so. It could be being around family. It could be being on holiday. It could be being having a roof over your head. Whatever you're grateful for today. Inhale each one of those things into your body. Exhale gratitude out into the universe. Inhaling, exhaling, inhaling, exhaling. And then whenever you're ready, just bend your knees and roll over to one side. Stay here for as long as you need. This is your time. I thank you for your time and allowing me into your space. And I look forward to seeing you next time.